Grenada's top-notch dive product was celebrated at the 2022 Grenada Dive Fest with a keen focus on conservation. While dive enthusiasts discovered and enjoyed Grenada and Cariaco's healthy reefs, amazing wrecks, and diverse marine life, each activity was framed with a conservation and educational component dubbed Conservation Conversations. On opening night at Victory Bar, CEO of the Grenada Tourism Authority, Petra Roach, welcomed all participants and highlighted how important conservation is at the core of the work of the GTA. We believe that at the core of everything we do in this country, in this amazing island, there has to be a legacy that is left. There has to be a focus on sustainability and conservation because we're really privileged at the GTA to have some amazing stakeholders within the dive industry. We recognize that diving is one of the strongest competitive advantages that we have. But we know that there are lots of diving sites everywhere in the world, so we want to make sure that we do ours with a difference. President of the Grenada Scuba Divers Association, Tom Gear, says conservation needs to be a nationwide effort. Conservation is something that has been sort of a life piece for myself. Um, it's a life piece for my children and my wife, and it's a fantastic to see something that we can continue to move forward as a group. It's, just, it's a nationwide effort. It's something that we all are taking part in. And then the best part to me is that the Scuba Diving Association, we're the educators. We're the ones, you're, we're your first contact. We're the place where you get to go learn, you get to go play, you get to laugh, you get to do all the other fun stuff. The first conservation conversation was centered around the impact of wreck dive sites on the marine environment. Day two of the Dive Fest at Monk Cinnamon focused on storytelling and inspiring people to join conservation movements. Former fisheries officer and member of the Grenada Coral Reef Foundation, Roland Baldio, says it is important to get communities involved in the storytelling. He gave an example of this in the fishing village of Grove as it relates to the importance of marine protected areas. The whole program itself, you try to get the whole community involved in conservation. And there was a competition in the OECS. And, you know, in, in Grove, we have the local, the most popular soccer artist in Grenada. So we involve him in what was happening in conservation. And this is Mr. Killer here. I remember we brought him in the Molina area. We gave him a crash course to do a scuba diving. He went down, saw in the bottom and so. And we had to produce a, a video. And we used the local schools in the area and that was a local school in a video on conservation in that community. Conservationist and international presenter Miranda Krestovnikov said the beauty of storytelling is finding a link to your audience. So important and people are so innovative about their ways of storytelling. So I'm sure a lot of you have seen the amazing Netflix My Octopus Teacher. I mean that is the, the prime example of the best story ever, the best connection a person having this personal connection with an octopus and you know I think we all were, were, were weeping at the end of it you know it's just really oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. octopus friend <laughs> that's what we need to do with nature and conservation day three of the dive fest focused on the invasive lionfish how they affect the marine environment and what is being done to address the growing problem participants were treated to a demonstration of how to properly and safely clean lionfish by Aquanauts dive master Crispin Mitchell. At the culmination of Dive Fest 2022, two participants gave glowing reports about their time spent in Grenada. Amazing speakers, um, and we've also gone diving. The diving was amazing as well. Um, we did a little bit of wreck diving and some lionfish hunting. Overall, it's been an amazing experience. The conservation conversations um, have just been so enlightening. I've learned a lot about marine protected areas um, and artificial coral reefs, which I think are so important in maintaining corals um, and the life around them. 
Um, and also this evening we were learning about lionfish, an in invasive species, uh, which was also so interesting, just learning how predators are adapting or not adapting to them. Um, so it's been a really enlightening experience and I've had some wonderful dives as part of it, so it's been a real privilege to experience Grenada in this way. To find out more about Grenada's dive product, visit www.purgrenada.com.